Twenty year old Joseph Reisner walked into the courtroom first. Like one other defendant, he told the judge he is unemployed and practically broke. Have any cash on hand? I believe I had 86 cents. 18 year old Natasha Cornett, the woman who tells her attorney she is the Antichrist, was next. In court, she was emotionless and polite. No, sir. The judge read the murder charges facing all four defendants for the killings of Vidar, Delfina, and Tabitha Lilylid. Police say the group shot the family's two-year-old son, Peter, who is still alive. The family's relatives from Norway watched. There's a common bond as far as the beliefs go, I think. Cornette's Kentucky attorney says all four defendants share an interest in Satanism. According to Eric Kahn, Cornette says the cuts in her arm, like the cuts you see here, are made to conjure up the devil. At age 13, she became obsessed with Ouija boards, and it grew from there. She got into Dungeons and Dragons, and she just it kept on. She started devouring books on witchcraft, and then finally she said she got to the point where the devil himself educated her instead of the books. She believes that she's the daughter of Satan. Defendant Edward Mullen's attorney offers a different picture of his client. He seems like a nice young man. And from what I've heard, he's been in the church for a while and somehow got involved with these people. I don't know how. The Lillilid's relatives dodged a media circus and left the courthouse quietly. Preliminary hearings for the four adults are scheduled for next week. Meanwhile, the family members of some of the defendants are expected to come to the Greene County Jail during visitation hours later this week. In Greenville, Jim Acosta, Action 10 News.